stony-faced Prince Charles pictured for first time since Harry insulted his parenting. The Prince of Wales visited the BCB International site in Cardiff today during his day-long visit to Wales. The future monarch was spotted for the first time since his son, Prince Harry, hit out at his parenting. During his lengthy conversation with host Stax Shepherd and Monica Padman, Harry said he doesn't want to pass on pain from his own experience to his son Archie and future daughter. He said, I don't think we should be pointing the finger or blaming anybody, but certainly when it comes to parenting, if I've experienced some form of pain or suffering because of the pain or suffering that perhaps my father or my parents had suffered, I'm going to make sure I break that cycle so that I don't pass it on. Basically, it's a lot of genetic pain and suffering that gets passed on anyway so we as parents should be doing the most we can to try and say, you know what, that happened to me, I'm going to make sure that doesn't happen to you. He added, it's hard to do but for me, it comes down to awareness. I never saw it, I never knew about it, and then suddenly I started to piece it together and go okay, so this is where he went to school, this is what happened, I know this about his life. I also know that he is connected to his parents so that means he's treated me the way he was treated, so how can I change that for my own kids? Harry and Meghan Markle stepped down as senior members of the royal family last year and have relocated to California. During his interview on the Armchair Expert podcast, said it was not part of his plan but sometimes you've got to make decisions and put your family first and put your mental health first. According to royal commentator, Roy Anika said Charles would have been bewildered by Harry's comments as he did his best to raise him and Prince William. Speaking to the Today program, Ms Nick Ha said, that was quite an extraordinary comment. The Prince of Wales, who I know was really cut up about the remarks Harry made about him in the Oprah interview, will be bewildered by this latest outburst. For better or worse, the people who know Prince Charles, and Prince Harry and Prince William, will agree he did his best as a single parent for a lot of the boy's childhood. And I think people will be bemused because we've seen insights, quite recently, of the warmth of that relationship. Harry reunited with his father and brother last month following the death of Prince Philip, the Duke of Edinburgh. The Duke of Sussex was spotted on camera speaking to his brother, seemingly putting an end to their ongoing rift. However, Ms. Nicka said William would not have enjoyed hearing his father come under fire again. She said, It's going to be very very difficult looking forward to July 1st when William and Harry are supposed to unveil a statue of Diana. William will not have enjoyed hearing his father come under fire again from Harry so soon after Oprah. It's going to be tough. Despite his claims, Harry previously defended his father's work as a single parent following the tragic death of Princess Diana when he was only 12. In a special program marking the 20th anniversary of the Princess of Wales accident in 2017, the Duke said, he was there for us. One of the hardest things for a parent to have to do is to tell your children that your other parent has died. This is not the first time Harry has attacked the firm after claiming his father and brother were trapped with the royal family. During his explosive interview with Oprah Winfrey in March, Harry said, I myself was trapped as well, I didn't see a way out. I was trapped but I didn't know I was trapped. And he added, my father and my brother, they are trapped. They don't get to leave and I have huge compassion for that.